Today I'm in Yilan Luodong in a forest culture center kind of things. Um, lots of trees, nice scenery, a small lake back there, and there is Xiao Rui Rui! Hi! And you can see I'm protecting my face from the sun with a mask and a hat and a sombrella. We rented an electrical bicycle and we are going to go around the lake, I think. So this is the electrical bicycle, well, car that we are going to go around the lake with. Here's the place where I grew up when I was a kid. And my dad was in charge of Operation the Handicap. I lived here for all my childhood. When I was a kid, this was not a street. Over there at the end of the road, um, there was a gate. If you have to come in, you will need to um, ring the doorbell for people to open the gate for you to come in. And where the black car is, there used to be a wall too. So um, when they finally removed the gate, it was a dead end street. And it was great for kids to play um, in Taipei because we don't need to worry about traffic. And of course, next door is the church and I spend quite a lot of time in their yard playing too. This is a great neighborhood. So here's a ramp. Um, people with wheelchairs can go up or you can use the stairs to go to the front door. The houses next to us or surrounded us were all one floor, old style Japanese house. This one hasn't been taken out for ages. The owner already moved out a long time ago and just sitting here, vacant. It will be a great ghost house. And when you come in here, it used to be the office. My dad and other person were working here. And then you got an open area for meetings, for having a party. And there's a kitchen. This used to be a bar. You can make drinks here, but 
we are packing, so it's full of stuff. They got the ping pong table. You can set it out and play, and a blackboard. And back there is our living space. We got one over here for guests. Like right there. And down the hallway, there is another living room. You've got a smaller party or a smaller meeting, they will hold it here. And here is the bathroom and bedrooms. So this room used to be a guest room too. And when I was a kid, I slept here. You go through my parents' room and and then over here is used to be my bedroom and used to be through this door right here you go out there was a backyard it's still there but the doors hasn't been used for a very long time and it's, I barely can open it here's the back door and then small balcony and then the small yard used to be the houses, the apartment here, or the big giant building here, they were all the same, like first floor Japanese style building. Uh, great view, and then they have big trees. Now the big tree is gone. Today is the last full day in Taiwan. I tried to help my parents do as much packing as I could, but they just have so much stuff that piled up in the last 40 years. It's um, it's scary and I kept digging out things I I don't even remember I have um, and I also do some own packing so I'm ready to go home tomorrow I will be leaving the to the airport six seven o'clock in the morning to catch my flight um, so the purpose for this trip is to play with my brother's son Rossi He's very cute. He's about one year and two months old. Adorable little boy. Most of the time he's happy and talking and playing. And um, just like every kid, when he is tired, he gets a little bit cranky. Um, but that's normal. Also, kind of helping my parents uh, packing up the house so, can, so they can move out of the house by the end of August. It's kind of sad because we have been, well, they have been here for about 40 years and we are leaving this place. So the last time for me to look at the place. And today is quite busy, I help them pack. I visit my dermatologist before I leave and looks like everything heals pretty well. And he said, just make sure you do some protections. That's very important. Um, if you have any questions, contact me. Well. I don't know what he can do since he's on the other side of the ocean. Anyway, but he, he is very nice. And if you feel like you want to go on a medical trip to Taiwan, I, I have a place or a recommendation for you. Um, also, to see my parents for this trip. They are, they are obviously getting older and I don't get to see them very often so two weeks a pretty good trip I think I'll do it more often it's time to go home and my gate has lots of Hello Kitty stuff 